The idiom "Po Jing Chong Yuan" originated from a book of Tang Dynasty, 1,300 years ago, which tells a story between Xu Deyan and Princess Le Chang. Let's learn about the detailed narrative. In the early Sui Dynasty, Emperor Yang Jian ordered his troops to destroy the Chen State in the south. Before the Sui army arrived, a scholar of Chen State called Xu Deyan had foreseen the state was about to perish. He said to his princess wife with tears in his eyes, "The collapse of the country is just around the corner. Being a princess, you will possibly be taken to the capital of Sui State." If both of us don't die, I hope we can reunite again. He took out a round bronze mirror and broke it into two halves. One half was given to Princess Le Chang. He kept the other half. They agreed with each other on the first Lantern Festival after separation. They could pretend to sell broken mirrors on the busy streets of Chang'an to look for each other. The Chen State was soon destroyed. And the Princess Le Chang was captured and sent to Chang'an, the capital of Sui Dynasty in North China. On the other hand, Xu Deyan traveled long distances to reach the Sui's capital. On the day of Lantern Festival, as promised, he took the half bronze mirror to the street to sell. He suddenly found an old man who was also selling the half mirror. He stepped forward and took a look at it, which perfectly matched his half mirror. The old servant told him that Princess Le Chang had become Duke Yang Su's concubine. Upon hearing the news, Xu thought the chance to see his wife was very slim, so he wrote a poem on the half mirror and asked the old man to take it back. After Princess Le Chang read Xu Deyan's poem. She cried all the days and stopped eating and sleeping. After knowing the whole story, Duke Yang was so touched by the adversity of the couple, so he invited Xu Deyan to his mansion for a meal, and returned Princess Le Chang to the letter. This idiom "Po Jing Chong Yuan" often refers to the reunion and reconciliation of the husband and wife after separation or breakup.